you put on this water resistant sunscreen, does it actually work? We take these UV beads that I bought. Yeah, <laughs> those. When they're out in the sun, they change color. When they're in regular light, they are white. We're gonna take some clear water. Clear water. <laughs> We're gonna just take some regular tap water. Oh no. <sighs> We're gonna take some salt water that's like about the salinity of like the ocean. Idea. Yeah. What if we ask her how much salt is in the average uh, sweat? No. How much salt is yeah. in the average this amount of water? There is an estimated 321,003,271 cubic miles of water in the ocean. Ugh. I'd love that ChatGPT. I don't even know what she was talking about. Eight grams of salt per cup of water, which is approximately 1.4. Teaspoons, okay. Sunscreen all over these beads. Pretty, pretty slimy and mixed up here. And then we're gonna put the beads in the water. I think we should do 15 minutes, an hour, and 90 minutes. Cause I wanna see what happens. It says after okay. 80 minutes. You got it. see what happens. Okay, you know what we could use? String. Do you have any string? Uh, Whatever you red. don't like. Red. Red thread is bad? Yes. Shall I start doing the other ones? Okay. Uh, oh no! Oh god. Oh buddy, you're doing, you're doing good work. I hate this so much. <laughs> we should just put them in the water, no string. Okay, we've got our beads, string beads. Nice work. Three in the... Regular water, three in the salt water. Took the beads, they clearly changed color outside, we sprayed suntan lotion on them. Mineral sunscreen? Or so we should see it. Spray. Here. Ah, it's broken. Okay, well let's try this one. Some bum. See how the color is definitely going out. Yeah, it's definitely working. And they just start going clear again. Sunscreen works. Use it. Just take the salt one out and we'll take it outside. We basically saw, even after 15 minutes, something is obviously happening. UV is still getting to these beads, it looks like. Water. You've got the salt water. It definitely, these things are definitely changing color. Well, my original hypothesis was, it would wash off a little of it, but not all of it. It washed off more than I expected. Yeah, you could even see the sunscreen in the water immediately. Yeah. I feel like the salt one might have been a little darker. I don't know why. Yeah, when we looked at the salt dish, it felt like even more sunscreen had kind of come yeah. off. Beads that have like been having suntan lotion on compared to like any of the water situations, it was kind of clear that the water made things worse. I think they say water resistant up to like 80 minutes. But then the directions is like, put an ounce all over your body. Repeat after two hours. But man, if you're sweaty and like you've got that salt water coming off your body, I'm not sure I would trust two hours. Waterproof sunscreen, good for 80 minutes? Deliver, you gotta deliver the catchphrase. No, you do it. <sighs> I would reapply if you go in the water. Every 30 minutes. I hope you're getting something out of these videos. This thing took a lot of work. Days. Weeks. The first time, I just dropped them. And that's why they had dirt in the, on them in one shot. The second time, I <laughs> fell and I dropped them. Hey, you want to be in the video? Okay. Yeah.